start a measurement from the home screen, you can simply click on Measure Zeta Potential. This automatically takes you to the Measure tab where you can either open an existing method or write a new method. To start a method, first type in the sample name. Then select the cell type. The most common cell for Zeta Potential is the folded capillary cell, such as the DTS-1070. This is primarily used for aqueous solutions. There are other cells, such as the DIP cell, that can be used if you are working with organic solvents or oils. Next, select your dispersant. The software will provide options within the library for compatible dispersants based on the cell type you have selected. The dispersant menu is using data for the refractive index, dielectric constant, and the viscosity at the measurement temperature. You can also add your own unique dispersant to the library by using the Edit button. In this case, we'll select Water. Select the project name for the location where the data will be saved, or create a new project. And hit the green checkmark button. Under the method builder, select how many times you would like to make the measurement. It's typical to measure in triplicate to observe any trends or establish consistency across multiple measurements. So in this case, we will select three. Next, type in your measurement temperature, which can range from zero to 70 C for zeta potential analysis. Add in any necessary equilibration time to bring the sample to the instrument temperature. Our default is two minutes, but this can be adjusted up or down depending on the temperature difference between your sample and the desired measurement temperature. You can save the method for future use, or simply insert your cell into the instrument and start the measurement. The measurement will first start with your equilibration step, followed by the optimization of voltage and attenuator settings. The measurement will then begin, which is usually very fast, even for triplicate measurements. You can view real-time data such as the phase plot, count rate, and zeta potential distribution, if applicable. In just a few short minutes, you will hear the audible tone that alerts you the measurement is complete. To open your data, you can navigate to the Analyze tab. Locate your project from within the Project Explorer. Select any data you would like to view. Use the Zeta workspace to view your results. Here you can see the phase plot, Zeta distribution if it was measured, and a statistics table showing results. 